Auguste Rodin made sculptures of extraordinary expressiveness. Rodin offers two hours of actors struggling to appear lifelike. For Vincent Linden, cast and bearded as the great man in this inert biopic from Jacques Dolan, that task entails gazing intently at statues, busts and naked models, looking gruff and serious, while the camera avoids close-ups of the detailing. Remember the artist, forget about the art. Critics at last year's Cannes Film Festival received Rodin as if they had collectively taken a marble anvil to the head. If the movie plays marginally better now, it still lacks an arresting perspective on its subject. Employing an episodic, borderline shapeless structure, it subscribes to the kind of screenwriting shorthand that prompts bad guffaws. He is coming to life. Rodin's lover and fellow sculptor Camille Claudel, Isha Higelin, exclaims as her mentor shapes his latest triumph. Soon you'll know Balzac as well as if you'd spent years with him. Hello, Paul, Rodin greets Cezanne. No, Station, Night, Rodin tells the photographer Edward, referring to the best time to shoot the finished Balzac monument. In the battle of the sexes by play between Rodin and Clotel, who struggles to be taken seriously as a sculptor because of her gender, it is possible to glimpse traces of tougher films that Mr. Doolin has made. Raja, from 2003, also dealt with a relationship imbalanced by age, wealth and colonial dynamics, but signs of life are few. A desaturated palette makes Rodin as monotonous to look at as it is to endure. Not rated. In French. With English subtitles. Running time, 1 hour 59 minutes.